What's up everybody, Philip Bridges here. I'm gonna show you how to replace your grill on your Ford truck. It's super easy to do, and we're only gonna use two tools. So stick around, and I'll show you how it's done. All right, you're gonna need a 732nd socket for this, and you're also gonna need a flathead screwdriver. So there are five bolts on the top of this grill that you're gonna wanna take off. And so you're gonna unscrew each one of them. And so you don't, so you don't lose these bolts. I recommend using a uh, magnetic uh, tray that holds these bolts in, in place. So you don't set them on top of the grill or something or the engine and they fall to the floor and you're looking for them everywhere. Trust me, I've done it before. It's not fun. So pick one of these up at AutoZone or eBay. They're really cheap. They're only like five bucks. So once you get the uh, bolts un undone, there are uh, five clips. Also on the bottom, I'll pry the top off just so you can, you can see this pop off. And then you're gonna push these clips in with your flathead screwdriver and you're gonna kind of give them a little uh, you're going to twist the top of the screwdriver and they're going to pop the clips out and you're going to want to do that on each one of these clips. Alright, take your time with these clips because you can break the plastic pieces off. So just, you know, just take your time doing it. They will eventually pop out. And so um, I'll show you what the new grill looks like after I get this out. And uh, I ordered it off of Amazon. And here's the new grill. I ordered it off of Amazon. I'll put the affiliate link in the description below. So it comes with five, uh, five of the new clips and they're really hard to get on. You take a flathead screwdriver and kind of twist the clip and you'll be able to stretch out the metal and you can just kind of slide the new clips on. But some of them I had to take a little a rubber mallet and give them a little tap on so that's not really two tools it's three tools but you know if you work at it you can make this all work with two tools all right after you get the clips on you're gonna put the new grill on we're gonna install this thing All right, we'll wanna make sure that the clips are lined up. There's five clips on the bottom, like I said before, and they're gonna go in these little slots. You wanna make sure that you line them up. Once you get them lined up, you're just gonna push on the grill and you're gonna hear, hear it snap into place. And just kinda go around each like area of the grill and just kinda give it a little tap to make sure everything locks in. Now we're just going to reinstall the bolts back onto the grill and this should go fairly quick. And once you're doing this, still just kind of make sure everything's snapped on. Double check everything. So just take your ratchet and retighten all these bolts. And that pretty much does it. Just wipe off any fingerprints or anything that you have on the grill. And that's it. So this project took not even 10 minutes to do. Um, if you liked it, uh, hit the like button, comment down below if you have any comments about it. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. I'm Philip Bridges and thanks for watching.